guys, it's me Roxy and also known as Amazing Roxy and today I'm gonna do a review and swatches and a demo of this um, palette and this eyeshadow and yeah I got this from Simply Spoiled Beauty if you miss my unboxing I will put it down below but yeah I've already done my makeup um, my only lacking is my eyeshadow so I'm gonna use this this one for my lid and this one for my transition area so yeah I'm gonna do a demo first and then I'm gonna do the review and swatches if it's okay for you guys and yeah so let's go ahead into the demo so first gonna go with my primer as always you need primer this a little bit goes a long way okay then I'm gonna go ahead using this color put it into my transition line it's kind of uh, brown soft it's just brown but it's much shade so I'm gonna do that I don't know if you can see my dog is barking outside no, it looks like that. I'm gonna apply it to the other side. It blends pretty good. So I know you can say because the sun the sun is setting, so the light is just in my face right now, but yeah, that, that's how it looks like, as you can see. Then I'm gonna go ahead, get this um, darker shade right here. Using the same brush, I'm gonna apply it to the corner. And just go a little farther in the crease. Dark in the outside part of my eyes. It's pretty good. It's not a lot of fallout. I'm so surprised. Because I thought it would be um, so much of a fallout. But yeah. So that's that. Woo. <laughs> then I'm going to blend it using my um, clean fluffy brush to prevent harsh line. I don't know why, but every time I put makeup on, my nose runs. Just blend it. Okay, now let's go to the lid part of the eye makeup. So I'm going to use this. I like this one because it's not like the next jumbo. You can't, you, you have to sharpen it, but you can just twist it and it'll go up like that. So I like that better. And when I, and when I swatch it, it looks going to be like this. So yeah, I'm going to put this in my lid and see what's happened. very sticky so I don't know if that's good or not yeah I'm gonna apply the other side this is like pigment you know like yeah it's glittery and stuff I kind of like how it stays in the eyes but it's just so hard to blend I think because it's like paste you're putting paste on your eyelid And then I'm gonna use this shade to highlight my brow bone. This one. 
the third one, third color, to highlight my brow bone because I don't think there's another lighter shade to use. So. I'm just gonna use that. Oh, I don't think it's. I don't think it shows up, but oh well. Wanna try? Now I'm gonna blend some more. It's pretty. I like it. I like the way it sticks to the to the lid, but it's just sticky. Then I'm gonna do it in the lower eye. Hmm. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and put mascara on to see what's gonna happen. It's kind of peeling out, like it's gonna go somewhere else. I'm gonna put another coat on it because I think it's moving away from my lid. So, yeah, that's that. I'm gonna put mascara on. This is the entire eye look. So let's go to the um, review of this one. I think this, um, the packaging of this palette is really, really hard. So that's good to protect the entire um, palette inside, the entire eyeshadow inside. But um, it got one, two, it got 12 shade here. It's like the it, it, it kind of like the Naked 2 palette from Urban Decay. The colors but the pan are smaller than what is in the Naked 2 and this two here are glittery. It has I think it has three to four much shadow much shade here and the rest are glittery so yeah it's it's not bad of a palette because because um because i think it's pretty good to wear because it's all neutral and stuff like that but i don't think the block is very good but yeah let's I, I like the idea of doing this so you can see the color inside of, of the palette and it has a little mirror but you can't hardly see the mirror there so I didn't like that I, it's a, it, I wanted like a, a little bigger than this one but nice for them to include mirror in there so that and it comes with the applicator the applicator is smaller than the the container so that it that took a lot of area for the applicator if they just um lessen the applicator's area size and let the eyeshadow a little bigger that would be awesome but okay so let's get into the swatch i will swatch everything from here up to here and i'll show you i was here is everything i'm gonna stand up so you can see that this is from the from the beginning of the line so this is matte 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 so there's tons of matte shade in this palette but look at how powdery are they they are very powdery so that's kind of no no because it's gonna have a lot of fallout but um some of these are not pigmented at all this one is really not i swipe my hands for like three times before it'll show up and this the color brown that i use in my transition area and yeah, it's not that good and Let's see, this is very, 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 very 
powdery, but I like that color because it's gold and stuff. But this one here is not really, really pigmented of a of a eyeshadow, but I kind of it's it's not bad. It's it's okay. And this is the this one. So that's that. It's very very pigmented but as I said when you apply it to your eyes it is so thick it's, it's a th so thick that you can't blend it so it kind of like oh oh but then when it, when you look at my eyes it's so pretty right so I kind of like the how it stays in the eyes but I just don't like the day uh, how it applies how it's it glides on my eyelid but this uh, this um, eyeshadow is not really bad of an eyeshadow I like that color right there like the gray and this is the black I thought it was it's shimmery see it has shimmer on it I don't know if you can tell but yeah there's shimmer and this is like purpley purpley brown shimmer thing like that so yeah, that's the swatches. I I think this is um it's it's an okay palette for like everyday use or nighttime use for like nightlife, go clubbing and stuff like that. But um, I must tell you that it has um uh, powdery effects. So fall out is gonna be gonna be um, much too much at this palette but it's not that expensive like the other you know high-end products so I think this is pretty pretty good so I think I'm gonna use this um, you know some more so I'm gonna look what the other colors would would like in my eyes and yeah and so this is yeah like a one thumb off for me because it's not so bad but it's not really really good you know what I mean so that's that and this one I kind of wanted to purchase more of this but I really don't like how it glides on my eyelid but it stays pretty good you know when you get wet it's gonna blot you know some it's gonna crease so I don't like that uh, my nose sweating. I don't like that part of the shadows because I want it to stay longer. But it's not really bad. I think it, I give this one thumb up because because it's it's very pigmented and I like that. I like that for an eyeshadow, but I just don't like how it applies on my eyelids. So. Yeah, that's all for my review and swatches and demo for this two thing. This uh, two things. So all in all, these products are okay. Not super super like, but I will get this um, more of a try. So. Yeah, I'll know next time. Maybe I just, you know, in a hurry this time. So, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know, do another looks or, you know, another eye look using this palette or this one and using my other palettes. Just a combination of other things. Maybe it applies better. So, yeah. So if you're interested in this, if it's it's not really a bad palette, so and a bad eyeshadow pencil, if you're interested in this one, I will put the link of the site down below so you can you can purchase this. And if um, I'm I'm I already done my makeup, so I will put all the makeup products that I used in my makeup today. And yeah, I hope you like my mini my review and swatches and demo of this product. And thanks for watching and see you in my next video guys. I hope you enjoy. Bye guys. 
It's amazing, me, Roxy. Sorry, I'm in my bathroom today because I wanted to try this um, deep cleansing nose strips that I got in my um, Simply Spoil.